Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard and we have some breaking news. Yes, this is our third video for today. But this is some breaking news. This is from our good friend, my good friend, John from Theme Park ERT. And I'm going to link his video up on the top right to see the full update that was just posted just a few minutes ago. And I'll also link it in the description box below. Definitely subscribe to his channel. He's a great person. Uh, I've been to the parks with him and even been on a, on his channel on a theme park ERT roundtable podcast last summer and that was super fun so definitely go check out his channel again i'll link in the description and link on the top for this full update but yes he does great every monday he releases a new six tags magic mountain update i'll be there on friday to check this out as well but he doesn't like clockwork every monday and to this week's update i asked him for permission to use this by the way track has arrived that's right RMC track has arrived. So if anyone who's wasn't sure or the rumors have been confirmed, it is an RMC Raptor coaster and the track is the yellow. This is a very interesting color choice because a lot of people thought it was going to be like themed to Joker. But then they saw an order of RMC supports leave last week from the the um the plant which i believe is in utah or colorado i think it's utah though um and it was marked for six flags magic mountain and the track supports were the track was yellow and here's the proof this is in the parking lot right on that overflow parking lot right now and this first flat button truck of some curved track supports for this rmc raptor themed to not joker anymore but maybe the Flash, but could be Shazam, I would think. I think like, you'd have to go with the DC character because it's gonna be right by Riddler's Revenge, um, the flat the DC Universe area, Batman, and the Metropolis area. So they're finally bridging that gap. We don't have that tidal wave there, which is not themed to anything. It'll be finally a one cohesive, massive DC area split between the DC, uh, the Batman area and the Metropolis area, or Gotham and metropolis which is pretty cool and but that's kind of i still feel like it's an odd color choice because you have beautiful batman's beautiful paint paint job which is the black or black or gray dark gray supports with the blue painting and they have Rid riddler's revenge with the green supports or green track and yellow supports now you can have this coaster right next to almost on top of or under riddler's revenge and actually some parts probably will be under like literally under riddler's revenge with a yellow track and maybe green supports or red supports, I feel like there might be a little mis mismatch of colors there for the just like for the eye or visually for the eye. But I don't know, maybe maybe it won't look too mismatchy. I just really wish they didn't wouldn't like use the same colors as Riddler again because they have the yellow supports with the yellow track, especially because. I mean, they might be going not through each other, but very close to each other. So, interesting color choice, but maybe, again, some people have said maybe the Flash, and some people, and then you may be asking, wait a second, there's already a Flash ride. Yeah, but that Flash ride is a basic carnival ride, and they can just do a quick paint job and re-theme, re name change in like a second if they really wanted to. Wonder Woman, same thing. They can love that one. They don't have to do a paint job. They can just re-theme that spinner. Uh, dizzy spinner thrill ride to some anything else, and but some people have their eyes maybe Shazam because Shazam is coming out soon sooner than the Flash. Flash is next year, but Sh Shazam I think is the uh, the November Christmas, or maybe it's next year, but it's sooner than the Flash. But so maybe to tie in to the new actually the Sh Shazam. I cannot speak. Shazam is next year. This is a movie one, or this coaster won't open until next year anyway. And I think Shazam does come out in the summer, and the Flash comes out maybe in the the holiday season of next year. But uh, so that may be a movie tie-in there. I don't know. I still wish it was the Joker. I really liked when um I forgot who it was, but they made that cool No Limits um kind of V P O V of a proposed RMC Raptor in the same spot with purple and green supports. I mean, that looked really cool, especially at nighttime. It looked 
absolutely cool. I, I really wish we were getting that ride. And we are getting that ride, just a different color. Um, and a different theme. But nevertheless, it's super cool to see track, uh, track finally arrive on site. I'll be looking for this and doing a full update on Friday. If you're asking why I don't go to Six Flags more, it's just been so hot and the park has so little shade. It's really hard. Even the last one I did, even though it was only in 90 seconds, that update, it was hard to film that one because it just got really hot. And I like the heat, but I even I started sweating by the time I, and I was only here for like an hour or so. Um, so uh, according to the weather forecast, it will be 90 degrees on Friday. It's 99 today over there. Uh, the coolest day will be on Friday. So that at least bearable, just kind of go and then get it over with and then come back and put it up by Friday evening or, or Friday afternoon or Saturday for you. And I'm super excited to see it. I just really wish again the park would add some more shade and anything of trees, just cheap canopies, anything because I mean it gets really hot over there in Valencia, especially because each, each summer seems to get hotter and hotter and hotter. But um, yeah, so this is super exciting stuff. What do you guys think about this? Again, check out Theme Park ERT's um, channel and this full video. We can see not just the track up, but track update, but a full construction update. I'll link his channel up above in the top right corner and in the description below. And yeah, super exciting stuff, guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. And as always, have a fantastic day.